Good day everyone! For today's video, we're going to study similar and dissimilar fractions. After the basketball game, 8 players ordered the pizza. They requested it to be cut into 8 equal parts. The fraction for this pizza is 8 eighths. The first player got 2 slices. The first and the second player got two slices. So this is six eighths. The third and the fourth players got two slices. So this is four eighths. The fifth, sixth, and seventh players got three slices. So this is one eighth. I noticed something about these fractions 8 8, 6 8, 4 8, and 1 8 are fractions that have the same denominators. Have you noticed that one too? 8 8, 6 8, 4 8, and 1 8 are what we call the similar fractions. When you say similar fractions, those are the fractions with the same denominators. These are some examples of similar fractions. As you can see, each set of fractions has the same denominator, that is similar fractions. Again children, when you say similar fractions, those are the fractions that has the same denominator. How about this set of fractions? What did you notice about their denominators? This set of fraction is what we call dissimilar fractions. Why dissimilar fractions? Because as you can see, their denominators are different. So when you say dissimilar fractions, these are the fractions with different denominators. Is that clear? Let's find out if the set of fraction is similar or dissimilar fractions. Let's have the first example. The first one is one half and the second one is one half. Is it similar or dissimilar? That's correct. It is similar fractions since their denominators are the same. How about this example? The first figure is eight tenths while the second figure is seven eighths. Is it similar or dissimilar? Very good children, it is dissimilar fraction because their denominators are different. How about this one? The first example is 5 6, while the second one is 6 6. Are they similar or dissimilar? Good job!